Hi people, welcome to my YouTube channel. It's Mokuhe Moiga once again. Today I was actually in the mood of just walking up and down and I got this idea I can just vlog and Wesley was not in me. So I'm sorry guys for the Wesley lovers, today he will not be around but I will be back. research on how many people know about PrEP and PEP in relation to HIV. So Cyrus, do you know anything about PrEP? No, not sure. And PEP? <laughs> I think so, something like Richard. Richard. So Richard, I'm going to ask you a few questions regarding to PrEP and PEP and HIV. So what do you know about PrEP? PrEP, I think are the drugs taken mm -hmm. uh, to prevent the user from getting in the Ah, before or after? Prep, before, pep. before, before. And pep? Pep is after. Pep is after? After you've been exposed to the risk. Oh. Yeah. After how long should you take pep after you have exposed yourself? So it's two hours. Yeah. So it's oh, two hours. nice. <laughs> Dennis. Dennis and, and Charlie. So today I'm doing a research on HIV, PrEP and PEP and Shanley too. Have you ever heard of PrEP or PEP? Yeah, I, I think I've ever heard of it. I'm not too sure. And you, Dennis? I don't think so. You don't think so? So Shanley, yeah. because I've ever heard of PrEP and PEP, what yeah. do you know? The, the PrEP, uh -huh. I think the drugs you take uh, before. Before, before? Before. Having sex for preventing yourself preventing, uh, uh, yeah, from, HIV from HIV and PEP yeah. and PEP to take oh. them after. after. So you're supposed to take them after how long? I don't know. You don't know. Sure, yeah. And PrEP is it a daily drug or my time that you just take because you want to take? I don't know. <laughs> okay, so thanks for okay. your answers. First thing first, so apparently people have been asking me, I'm a medical scientist, I should be having a lab coat. So why am I not choosing the lab coat on my blog? So the thing is guys, yes, I know I'm supposed to be having a lab coat on, but I lost it. And my sister who's also a paramedic has to study with it. So she goes with it to school, so I'm sorry. But on today's topic, we're going to talk about PrEP and PEP. So what is this? What is PrEP and what is PEP? So PrEP, these are the HIV drugs that you actually take before you expose yourself. The pre and the post, actually, the PEP ones are the post. You use them after you have actually exposed yourself after 70, before within 72 hours. And how does this PrEP and PEP work? So let's get the real talk first. So HIV attacks, the viruses attack your immune cells, mostly the CD4 cells. So when they attack the CD4 cells, since they cannot multiply and replicate on their own, they have to rely on our cells. So once they attack one CD4, they actually take control of the DNA and affect that one cell, then it continues spreading the the replication of HIV is so fast, my dear one. So after it replicates, it actually spreads, spreads, and the immunity system cannot handle it. And that is what you call the HIV effect. Take and pray for like seven days. Your CD4 cells are actually protected from HIV. So when HIV, the virus, tries to get at you, the T cells are actually protected. And boom, you cannot actually get HIV. And just like that, you're protected. And for the PEP, you take them within 72 hours for a 28 days feel. It has serious effects, but what's really important, you having the virus, are you just being safe away from the virus? So again, facts that you need to know about when you're taking PrEP or PEP. One, it does not protect you from getting pregnant. Two, it does not protect you from actually getting an STI. Three, for PrEP, you have to take it for, for, uh, for some time first, a few days, like seven days, so that you actually gain the protection. And for the PEP, you have to take it within 72 hours. 
for 28 days. Another thing you need to know about this disease is that A, it's not a cure for HIV. And again, it's not a vaccine for HIV. So these are the new methods of preventing HIV and it's actually safe. It has been tested by the researchers, by the scientists and the health practitioners and I can tell you this, for sure it works. It's better to be safe than sorry. Pleasure doing these vlogs and I love educating people. So I hope today you've got something to take home. Plus this drug are for those who are actually HIV negative people. Like, comment and subscribe. Bye bye. Always a pleasure. From Okuhe Mweka.